ברוכת האדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם שהכל ברא לכבודו ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם יוצר האדם ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם אשר יצר את האדם בצלמו בצלם דמותיו ניתו והתקין לו ממנו בניין עד העד ברוך אתה אדוני יוצר האדם שאוס תסיס ותגל העקרה קיבוץ בנה לתוכה בשמחה ברוך אתה אדוני משמח ציון בבניה שמח תשמח רעים האהובים כשמחך יצירך בגן עדן מקדם ברוך אתה אדוני משמח חתן וכלה ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם אשר ברא ששון ושמחה חתן וכלה גילה רינה דיצה וחצבה אהבה ואחווה שלום ורעות גילה רינה דיצה וחטבה אהבה ואחווה שלום ורעות ואל אדוני אלוהינו ישמע בעד יהודה ובחוצות ירושלים כל ששון וכל שמחה כל חתן וכל קהלה, כל ששון וכל שמחה, כל חתן וכל קהלה. כל מתחלות חתן מחופתם, ונעלים משתי נגינתם. ברוך אתה אדוני, משמח חתן עם הקהלה. Praise are you God who brings forth fruit from the vine. Praise are you God who shapes the universe. All things created speak of your glory. Praise are you Holy One who fashions each person. We praise you God for forming each person in your image. You have planted within us a vision of you and given us the means that we may flourish through time. Praise are you creator of humanity. May Israel once bereft of her children now delight as they gather together in joy. Praised are you, God, who let Zion rejoice with her children. Let these loving friends taste of the bliss you gave to the first man and woman in the Garden of Eden in the days of old. Praised are you, the presence who dwells with bride and groom in delight. Praised are you, who lights the world with happiness and contentment, love and companionship, peace and friendship, bridegroom and bride. Let the mountains of Israel dance Let the gates of Jerusalem ring with the sounds of joy, song, merriment, and delight, the voice of the groom and the voice of the bride, the happy shouts of their friends and companions. We praise you, God, who brings bride and groom together to rejoice in each other. Baal Shem Tov taught, from every human being there rises a light that reaches straight to heaven. And when two souls destined to be together find each other, the streams of light flow together and a single brighter light goes forth from the united being. Aaron and Esther, you uh, are married in the Jewish tradition, which is portable, but you also are being married in Hawaii. This is a very, very special place and which has its own traditions. So I'm now going to uh, invite you in a moment to present lay to one another. The spirit of aloha is a way of life and well-being that has been embraced by native Hawaiians for hundreds of years. Traditionally, the word aloha was a greeting reserved for loved ones by first rubbing noses 
and then inhale, inhaling each other's breath. Alo means in the presence of, ha means breath of life. In the ancient language of Hawaii, the lei has always symbolized an extension of love and the joining of ohana, or family, and lokahi, unity. In your union, living your lives together in the spirit of aloha acknowledges the divine within each of you and creates a solid foundation of trust and unity. Living aloha, you will share the path of the heart to go beyond where you have thus far been in your capacity to love and be loved. It is a courageous path, for it is the path of the heart that leads from this day toward many beautiful tomorrows and more happiness than either of you imagine possible. Always keep smiles on your faces and aloha in your hearts, because it is the light in the window that tells people that you are at home. Aaron and Esther, as you exchange these lay, you will begin to weave your own lay of life, where we hope aloha will always live in your hearts, souls, and unions. Ride with me. Since both of you have acted out of love and affection, maybe not too much affection, <laughs> acting in accordance with these rites and ceremonies instituted by our holy Torah and in accordance with the laws of the state of Hawaii, you, Aaron, and you, Esther, are now husband and wife. We will conclude a Jewish wedding with, this, with the priestly benediction followed by the smashing of a glass. This act reminds us of the broken souls in this world who yet wait for a day of celebration and joy. As we include them in our thoughts, we ask God to make their lives whole again and bring to them the happiness that Aaron and Esther enjoy today. Between now and then, let us pray that however many pieces this glass will break into, so may Esther and Aaron's happiness be multiplied. And now we say in ancient words, May Adonai bless you and protect you. May Adonai show you favor and be gracious to you. Isa Adonai panave lecha, may asem lecha shalom. May Adonai show you kindness and grant you peace. Mazel Yeah, Israel. 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 Yeah, Israel.